Hello, friend. I'm Mormozine, and today, if you love Thanksgiving, watch the rest of this video. And today, we're talking about how to organize a Thanksgiving potluck. <coughs> a Thanksgiving potluck can be a great way to entertain at home without having to do all the work yourself or shoulder all the expenses. It will take some planning and organization, but could make all the difference between a fun Thanksgiving and one where you're stuck in the kitchen all day cooking while you worry about your bills. Here's how to organize the Thanksgiving potluck in 12 different steps. Number one, make your guest list. Decide who is coming, make a list, put in their contact information, and note down anything you know about their food preferences, such as vegetarian or their allergies, such as nuts. Send out the invitations and ask them to RSVP. Also note if they are going to bring a guest or whole family in your final tally of how many people you need to feed. Two, you take the turkey and main dishes. You should be responsible for the turkey and main dishes. Determine how much you will need in order to feed all of your invited guests, plus a few extra portions just in case, or for leftovers. 3. List the sides and essentials. In a word processing document, <clears throat> list all of the sides you would like to have as an accompaniment to your main courses. For example, if you're serving turkey, your sides would likely be stuffing, green bean casserole, sweet potato casserole, corn. You could also list desserts like pumpkin pie, cheesecake, apple pie, angel food cake, and so on. For drinks, depending on what you feel is appropriate to serve, you might list cranberry juice, seltzer, Coke, Sprite, beer, or wine. Include food allergies to avoid without naming any names, and ask anyone to email you back with any issues you might not know about just in case. Also, ask them to check this with their guests if they are bringing a friend or a date. Get them to commit. Once you are happy with your list, post it on Google Docs or Google Drive and invite people to share the file. They will get a link emailed to them. Ask them to pencil in their name next to one or more items they would like to contribute to the feast. Make space for all the contributions. Set up a buffet table where everyone can add their items as they arrive. If the table is small, put any desserts in the kitchen until they will be needed. Note, some of them might need to be kept cold in the fridge or freezer. 6. Organize lots of serving utensils. These are essential so your guests can help themselves. 7. Be ready to microwave. Most of the dishes will, will be, that arrive will be warm at best, so be prepared to heat them up in the microwave. 9. Organize glasses and ice. This will help the beverage serving go smoothly. 9. Have small plates and utensils ready for the dessert course. Have these items ready for easy serving. 10. Decide if you will serve coffee or tea. These hot beverages are nice with dessert, but they will require organization and cups, mugs, milk, sugar, spoons, and so on. Don't forget the extras and condiments. Butter, mayo, and so on will help enhance the meal. Have plenty of napkins and paper towels. This will help Keep things neat and tidy and enable you to cover any spills quickly. If you are hosting Thanksgiving this year, a potluck can be the way to go. Use these 12 steps to help you get organized.
and thanks so much for watching and please comment thumbs up or thumbs down and click the links in the description have a happy thanksgiving thanks so much